I actually have a Man. very big penis. I thought you were gonna say pussy. No, it's actually like. Hey, hey, let's respect this area. What? 2024 is my year to be the best version of myself. No, I'm gonna be quiet. I'm enjoying the food. Oh. Uh -huh. Don't do it. That was insane. Was you are awesome. lucky you are so pretty, because if you weren't, I would have just been by Felicia. You talk a lot of shit for someone who was crying and begging me to come back. <sighs> Yo. <laughs> oh, dear God, please let me get a lot of followers from the stream today. And please allow me to pretend that I actually like Nick. <clears throat> hey, man. Oh, here it is. I keep confusing my drug dealing phone with my main phone. Look what Nick got for me for Christmas. I'm flexing everyone. It's real. Mm. Uh, Bro, give me that. <laughs> Dig it out of my asshole if you want it. I will. Here, look what I have. Only for the finer things. Look, help him. Oh, fuck yes. Thank you. Sir, help him. It's like a one roll. Of... Oh my God. Cheaters win. They really do, don't they? <laughs> see? God damn, dude. Jay, okay, see how he went and grabbed that shit? Despite how good I keep my hygiene, moisturize my face, look good as a 34-year-old, one thing I, I've i struggled with my whole life is beard dandruff. Beard dandruff? You want to know what's funny about the beard dandruff? I also have, like, chin dandruff. And two days ago, I look at my chin, right? I'm like, why is it so gray? Yeah. And I take my, my, my fingers and I go in my hair and I grab a bit of it. And I, I just peel off an entire layer of just dead... My, I had, like, a, I had like a, a chin of dandruff. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Siri, would you explain the premise of today's show? Because me and Siri are starting a little bit of a mini series together. I enjoy going out to really nice restaurants. It's one of the things that I personally enjoy. It's not even particularly because the food is always good. The experience is always interesting to me. I like going to these places that people watch. I love how seriously some places take themselves when they have tasting menus. When they're like, ah, dish number six. The chef recommends that you close your eyes uh, and sip, sip the sake right after tasting this meat. And uh, just uh, let it, let it, let it taste for a few seconds. And I'm like, oh my God, that's hilarious. Like, bouge is hilarious to me. Bouge? Yeah. That experience is great. And I think it'd be sick to share that with you guys because it's gonna be hilarious. It'll be very funny. It will be interesting. And not everybody wants to go to those restaurants. This is actually a shared channel series. Yes. We will be doing the finest restaurants on Sears channel at nighttime. You know, we're talking the types of restaurants Can't that have a on. tasting, when I say mumbo jumbo, I'm talking about a place that is very self-serious. You sit down, they give you a plate. It has an oversized plate with just a little thing on it, mm -hmm. a bunch of drizzle, and they're like, this is the omne fish au flour. Yep. Le flour and then you like eat it and you taste it. And then they take the plate away. Then they bring you another plate. And that's yep. what tasting menus do. And it's 95% placebo. Yeah, there's supposed to be like one or two bites. And you're supposed to like, ah, oh, that was incredible. And then they give you the next plate, and it's like incredibly overpriced. Dude, whenever whatever. they bring tiny plates like that, I just slurp glurp in there. It's just like one bite. It's annoying. Yeah, but people aren't going there particularly to get full. They're going there for some sort of experience, which is chef handmade this uh, tasting experience. And then after 15 dishes, you might be full. And you've also spent $400. That's yep. hilarious, and not everybody wants to do that. So I say we do that, so chat doesn't have to. How brave of me? Uh, hey, we are throwing ourselves out there. So I'll tell you something I'm not going to do. I'm not going to run 10 miles in the mud, okay? <laughs> yeah. I'm not going to do that. No one asked you to. Do I'm not going to get a robot dog and let it f me in the ass. <laughs> right? Extra, extra and that's why they're doing better than us. Because they get f in the ass by robot well, dogs, not, and that, we don't. Not that word. You want to know why Like, I don't care if we've ever been on the moon, or I don't care if the Earth is flat? So what if it's true? How does that affect your daily life? Does it really matter? Is that really something that you want to put any thought into when you could be thinking about how to better yourself, you know? Am I crazy? Well, here's the thing. To some people it matters, to some people it don't. Yeah, but why would it? Like, let's let's say like- It matters to- Let's say it's like, okay, you can spend an hour researching if the earth is flat, or you can be spending an hour getting better at Apex Legends, right? Like. Sorry, MK Ultra was kicking in. Okay. Um, you could also just apply that logic that. to anything about life. Well, no, because some things you are. Could some say, things why are. Why care about history? Why care about? Well, you learn about history, space, so so you, you know? so you don't make the mistakes of history, and you know where you come from. So it's kind of important. Where is this flat? I don't want to walk off the edge of it. 
That's why I like furries, right? Oh, man. Because they're doing what they want. Because they're just doing... Just love dog f***ers, man. They're doing what they're doing, and it don't matter what they're doing, because it don't matter. You know, it's not like... So the problem with the flat earthers is they're always trying to convince you that it's flat. Like, you can believe what you want to believe, dog. Leave me alone, right? Yeah. But the furries, when's the last time someone could try to convince you to be a furry? Horse cock, horse cock. I've actually never, there's never shock. been one person who's ever tried to convince me to become a furry. Not once, yeah, okay? They don't leave their house. Every furry that I've ever met has been wonderful to Which me. furries have you met? e -Rob. Nah. But, but then people are always like, well, how come people back in the day weren't so like depressed or whatever, right? Was well, because they didn't have time to think about it because they were out the pyramids. They were building the pyramids 12 hours a day. You really don't have time to think about. They were worried about the potato famish. You know, right? Isn't that kind of how it is? Maybe I'm wrong here. Is that is that kind of what's going on? Horse cock, horse cock. Because like when I was younger, my mom would, 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 would say this saying to me. She was like, an idle mind is the devil's workshop. That's what she would say. So Melina's turned into like a massive like degenerate. I'm excited all f***ing ready, bro. Guys, this is, this is the first episode of Fine Dining with NMP Law and Sear. Here we are at this lovely, lovely, highly rated, exciting restaurant. Let's go. Look wow, at this, guys. Dude. We got a lot of beautiful fine drinks dining. here. This is Fine Dining. Oh, thank you. you got plants. Here we are, open bar. Hello. Hello. Hi, guys. Good. How's it going? Thank if you. you guys ever yeah, it looks good. Me to any of these streams, I'm always down for a free meal. You're invited. That's why you're here. Yeah. Is it free? Hell yeah, brother. Nick looks good. Thank you. You guys want to see her outfits? Uh, Nick and Melina actually bought this black shirt, Levi pants. Your mom loves this fit as well. Okay. I got this off-white jacket that I got in Vegas whenever we were shopping around, and Nick was miserable. I have a little turtleneck, off-white trousers. Cute little Playboy socks with my Prada loafers. Damn. Ew, porn? Ew. I don't do the porn thing. This jacket is from ASOS, tall section, because mm -hmm. you know tall. Shirt, Will Neff. Woo. Pants, Reformation. Woo. Shoes, ASOS, I don't know. Woo. Necklace from Nick, from Van Cleef. Oh, uh. oh my gosh, Nick. David Uriman. David Ehrman. Oh. oh so I just got, this is the sear fit, you know? I just hooked it up. I got whatever this is, and I got whatever that is. And then I got my Jordans. Very nice, yeah. So a couple days ago, right, I was in the shower, all right, doing my business. I don't like Let me tell you why. So I use my phone, and I go in incognito mode, Stop right? Stop thinking about him in the shower. Right? But then, like, I forgot to close the browser. So when I picked up my phone later, it was the it was the same video. No, that literally happens to me all the time. Yeah. I look at Reddit and then I open up Reddit later and it's like, oh. Yeah. Great googly moogly. Yeah. And then I got then I got horny again, so I had to do it oh. again. All right, guys. Okay. Cheers. Skull. Don't smell it. Cheers. Don't smell it. My soju tastes good. Oh, the soju this, it does taste good. It does taste good. The to uh, wait, wrong wrong, wrong, wrong glass. glass. You can't cheers. <laughs> <laughs> uh, he picked up his water glass. To Nick's parents making love. To yep. Nick's parents making love. Yep. Cheers, chat. And to Melina being back. Oh my god, this is very, um... It's dank. Well, it's not flavored. It's straight up what it is. I mean, yeah, it's so It's just... Yo, why? Why Why would you purchase this? What'd you say? Beautiful? I missed y'all. I missed you too. What? Dude, I drunkenly agreed to join E-Rob's flag football team, but I'm proud of drunk. No, you were so excited. I got invited to that too. I want to do it. You should join too. The problem... But they said they specifically needed women. Yeah, but the problem is like... Okay. I actually have a Man. very big penis. I thought you were gonna say pussy. No, it's actually like. Hey, hey, let's respect this area. What? No, it's 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 massive. Like. Ooh, it's like beautiful. So oh my gosh, they're so cute. <laughs> Oh, that looks so good. God. My goodness. Thank you. That looks um, amazing. May I have a K drop, please? Am I weird that I really just want the fried chicken? Is there meat in this? I don't know. Let's go for it. <clears throat> what is that called, Moino? It's rice cake. <clears throat> it explodes in your mouth. There's soup in there. Something exploded in my mouth, that's for sure. Mm. It's, got, it's got like a ground beef in it as well. It's kind of hot. Is it supposed to be hot? <laughs> <laughs> like spice? <laughs> it's, yeah, it's pretty spicy. Wow. This I is think, fine I think, dining. I, th I think it's that jalapeno on top. Can I try that? that that's really yeah. good, the chili, the chili like oil there. This is, I'm struggling to get this piece of chicken out of here. This is really like, good fried chicken. Have to pay a lot. Really? Yes. You want me to try this, uh, yes. what is it called? Sorry, Taboki. The spaghetti? Not really, but 
It's like a get it, you gotta get, you gotta get in the sauce. That sauce is oh, all yeah, the sauce flavor. It up. No, you gotta, you gotta, well, I'm not you eating the whole thing at once. I'm just gonna stick it, it in stick half it in my mouth because this is a weird thing. You gotta pinch it big time. I'm trying to pinch it, but it keeps falling out of my thingy. Pinch it harder. Did you like it? Oh yeah. Let me guys ask you this. What is better? Let me guys ask you this. Let me ask you guys this. What is better in your humble opinion? Uh huh. Food mm -hmm. or sex? Food. Mm. I get to enjoy food three times a day. Yeah. There's no way I'm getting three times a day. I'm so sorry. You could just have a fuck ton of food, honestly. Different types of food, yep. wherever you go. And unless you're a slut, I don't mm -hmm. see you doing that with sex. Try it? So, Chad, if you're a slut, props to you. No, it tastes good. I just can't do it consistently because I'm a big baby. I, I I am slowly learning to get over it. I'm slurp blurping this, though. This and is I, delicious. I think by, by the end oh of the year, God. I'll be able to eat spaghetti. <laughs> Look at this. That's the goal. He doesn't eat spaghetti? Nope, and I think by the end of the year we'll be able to get there. 2024 is my year to be the best version of myself. No, I'm gonna be quiet, I'm enjoying the table. Oh. Uh -huh. And with a partner like her, I'm definitely gonna be able to achieve these things, because she always has my back and wants me to succeed. How old are you? I am 32. I thought you were 40. Lots to ponder. No. JK, you look good. Thank Guys, you. we can't leave food. Who's eating the last ones? Rock, paper, scissors. All right, soup dumpling, you ready? No, it's okay, I'm on somewhat of a diet. And you are the guest star, well, so. Bob does well. True. Actual, actual. God damn, rock, paper, scissors me. Actual members. Rock, get... paper, scissors me, just because you said that. Right. Rock, rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Uh. Ooh. No, 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 see, look, 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 she's looking to throw something. Don't do it. That was, that was insane. She's you are, you are lucky you're, you're so. You're lucky it was not tomato sauce. You are lucky you are so pretty, because <laughs> if you weren't, I would have just been, bye, Felicia. You talk a lot of shit for someone who was crying and begging me to come back. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> Peach, would I be doing that? Like, holy Peach, shit! Come on. Like seriously? 100%. No. I can see you crying. You better so watch the what the. Peter's win. Peter's win. Yeah, Chad, do you believe that? Like, was I crying from waiting to come back? Like, it's on Twitter. It's public. No. Or him crying for me to come back. No, it's not. Like, that's just no way that's true. Look how pretty my girlfriend is. Uh, someone's ever gonna how pretty she is because she's just being so fucking mean. I'm not mean. Peach, do you think she's mean? No. All I can think about it right now is Nelson. Why are you addicted to video games? I think Melanie's already a hard worker. That's not true. It's only when I want to. It's sure. only an inspired worker. So once a year, does Wild West, takes three months off, doesn't elaborate. I'm sorry I was sick and my grandma died. Now you made me feel like a dick. You should. <laughs> sorry. Well, my grandma also died. How many years ago? I don't remember because I didn't go to well, the funeral. mine died two months ago. I win. Yep. Waiter. <laughs> This is an empty room. Please chill. <laughs> she, it's, there's no one in here. Anal, like, it's completely Shh. empty. It's, 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 the music's I'm so, so loud. I'm so sorry. She's I'm so sorry. Like yeah, she's, she's an alcoholic. Like Dude, you've been asking about dildo technique? Anal. It's completely empty. They can't empty. hear you through the other side of the wall. You know what I'm gonna start doing? And you really inspired me. Your mom? Oh. <laughs> hey, going back to where That's you came from? That's not funny. <sighs> What? That's not funny. Yeah, it is. She's gonna be mad at me because you said that. Well, it's not my problem. Yo, bring it in. No, what I'm really gonna start doing is I'm gonna start dressing better. So here's the plan. Yeah. I think it'd be cool if I got my ears pierced. What do you think? Yeah, go for it. I really, cause I'm, I, I, I'm all about you taking taking aesthetic risks. No, no, it's ears pierced and the nice diamond earrings. Looking like looking like a young, uh, Pete, I mean, Odell Beckham. <laughs> well, you have very petite ears, so you don't need to buy big diamonds. I think, when they look too I big. think like a small hoop, a small silver hoop. Yay, thank you, thank you so much. Thank you. Oh my God, this okay, is like a lunch yeah. plate. Okay. You can just put them across the table, I know. Wow. That's the bulgogi beef, that's really good. These are the mushrooms. Reminds me of like a school lunch. I love it. I know, isn't it fun? You're feeling it. All the rice bowls. <clears throat> we like to show the people watching, uh, you know, different things. You know. Yeah. This is definitely unique and new. I watched this video where someone puts this in front of their mouth oh, and then they, they put, put meat in front of it and they ate it. You want me to eat seaweed? I'll try it first. Look, 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 look. Here's a challenge. Whenever I was really high in Colorado. Look. <coughs> oh. Don't smell it. It does not taste like it smells. It doesn't mm. smell like anything. Okay, good. So what, do I put meat in there? Just what? like this. But why seaweed, though? Just shut the f up. Okay. I know. I'm gonna call this the peach jars. Uh, I don't think I can take claim to that. Why do you enjoy that so much? Mm. 
It tastes like PetSmart. Peach tastes like PetSmart? Yeah, why the f did you name it after me and then call it PetSmart? F you. No, it, no, honestly, look at me. F you. But it tastes good because I love PetSmart. He yeah, does I eat dentist things. I saw the way Kevin looked whenever Melana came back. You didn't take care of him. He deserved more love. Someone in chat goes, he's right. <laughs> Brav. You know what, Nick? What? Miso soup up, means something. Try that. Why are you feeding him so uh, essentially? That's my boyfriend. This is actually really good, chat. You know what, by the way, Melina? I've noticed you only care when people like physically touch me. That's the only way I can make you jealous. Yeah, because that's mine. Mm. No one can touch it. Uh, Aw. Okay. Are you going to touch it, though, or am I going to touch myself? I don't know. Are you going to keep listening to Kesha in the shower every morning? Stop. Mm. Tick tock on the clock. <laughs> Would you trust me and do the combination again with the seaweed? I would trust you with my life, Peach. I, I think Peach, this Peach. Is so much I trust you more than I trust Melena. I wouldn't go that far. No, I'm not kidding. Like I would rather spend time with you than with her. It's Malena, crazy. I can't control what he says. I'm so sorry. Well, do you like you like me now better than uh, you know, 15 years ago? The goalposts keep on moving. Like, 20. Oh, moved again. How old was I 15 years ago? We don't talk about that. So, Melena. What, seriously, do you like old Nick or new Nick better? Why are you fish for compliments? I'm I already not, told you every day, good job. No, what? I'm just asking you, like, who do you like better, old Nick or new Nick? I'm gonna make a little sushi. Okay, Sierra, do you like old Nick or new Nick? You're the same Nick. Really? I like the new motherfucker standing before me in his suit. Hey, see? Old Nick wanted to put That's this my on. dog. That's my dog. And while y'all hoes hanging out, <laughs> the bros gonna be hanging out. Yeah. Hey, I haven't seen you do this. We hey, ain't no fucking shit. Yeah, yeah. N the new Nick's gangster, the old Nick was a fat loser. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> That's You're still so a loser. Neat. You're okay. just not fat. I feel like I'm the eating this like an idiot. The way you hold spoons me the f out. And Why? I never wanted to say that, but it really He eats like a toddler, like this. Yeah. Like you hold your spoon like this. And you scoop towards yourself. Is but it you, crazy that I'm just... You're like gripping it as if it's going to fly away. <laughs> yeah, I got a strong grip. You, oh my God. All my boys should know that. You know that, right, sir? Oh, yeah, bro. Huh? Okay, you were your left hand then. What? Do you sometimes switch it up because you're bored? You're like, oh, I'm gonna try my other one today. I took etiquette classes for six years. Still post pictures of my feet, but I took the classes. I'm talking about masturbating. What's your What's your wiki feet? Nine point seven. Damn. Mine is like four. Melina, you have the sexiest oh, toes. I have the crustiest feet. I'm looking it up. No! Yeah, that back. Wait, Sierra has one as well. Yes. Or do I have a wiki hey, feet? Wow. Ooh. But there's more. Okay. There's hey, more we food. We just want to try everything. Here, I want to. Say, Thank you. I'm not kidding you. It's like some of the best kimchi I've ever had. Okay. Everything has been amazing so far. It tastes wow. really good. These are some weird tastes, man. Weird as in good or new? New. Okay. Melina, how are we gonna get our kids to try new things and not end up like me? Are you squeezing out pups? Pups? I'm gonna squeeze your f***ing brains out unless you shut the f*** up. Oh, we got, I only got one. No, you don't. You have half a brain. You shouldn't be mad about this because this is literally what you were put on the earth to do, Melina. Create new life. That's the gift that you were given. I can't create new life. You can. I, if I could, I would impregnate myself and have children right now with myself. So you know cute. what? You should pro like, that fits the bill more. I can imagine you more pregnant than me. You're like a seahorse. You just call me fat? No. No, I, I can I can imagine like seeing you pregnant and you doing like a baby shower. And like you crying. Because I've seen that so many fucking times. Damn, dude. Are we just not respecting boundaries? You want me to start talking about things on stream that you are not comfortable talking about? Let's talk about the apocalypse in 2021. I apologize. And hopefully you enjoy your food. It's been very delicious. I hate whenever you look at me, whenever something's happening, it's, it's stressing me out. <laughs> I'll, bring you all down. I'll bring you all down with me. Guys, follow the stream if you're having fun. This is typical Nick and Melina banter. We love each other very much. I can't eat noodles. I can't eat noodles. Yes, you can. I can't. Peach, my love, I cannot eat those. What? Glass noodles? I can't. It's probably the same as that, right? So this is good. I didn't know my boy was such a pussy. <laughs> I know that much. <laughs> hey, come and hang out with me when you ain't such a pussy. <laughs> we gotta bring the food back. <laughs> wow, ladies, this was this was filling. I think I'm done for the rest I'm of the day. I'm bringing the food home. I think it's a good time Guys. to end it. You don't want to talk about the food a little bit more? No, no, no. Let's just enjoy it amongst friends. I think this was a great so, stream, great episode. An incredible experience <laughs> yeah. here. Um, we, will, we will say that the name of the restaurant when we're not streaming today, um, but the food has been incredible. It's called Oseo. The staff has been incredible. Incredible. On Street, the Austin. drinks have been Come incredible. Try the food. The yeah. service is, they've been incredibly nice giving us this entire room. This is the first episode of Fine Dining. Fine Dining. Fine Hashtag Dining. Fine Dining. With NMP Lol and Sear. Yeah. With the a company of special guests, Milena. Hello, I'm special. And Peach Stars. Yeah. yeah. Absolutely. 
there will be another one coming up. We'll find another one. Fine dining, guys. Fine dining. Fine dining. Is that good? See, look, it's in their heads now. <laughs>